Hey YouTube, this is Gohan from Dragon Ball Z. You're watching Amatu Ray Killer HD, the ultimate Super Saiyan. Hey, what is up guys? It is me, Amatu Ray Killer, bringing you a video on Dragon Ball Idol. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the new event, new hero incoming. This little thing is actually very cool it is a challenge now it does show you the illustration of the unit so like if you want to see what it is all the skills and whatnot if it's worth it if it's not worth it to your team of course um but if we do look at it pretty easy affinities we got zatmasu miracle trunks and super saiyan blue goku all these can be attained in hero rescue he is more of a dodgy uh skill unit he does have the ability to stun the whole uh team for one turn also does crit aura, which is actually kind of cool. He also does dodging after a person dies on the team. Um, he has teleportation. And then another thing is, is that uh, whenever he dodges, he re he gives that unit that attacks him a damage reduction. And then if he attacks that same unit, then he gets stunned for that turn with his normal attack. Now, the thing is, is that um, this unit attacks random units with damage reduction from zamasu himself then he will stun if it's a damage reduction from somewhere else it won't stun i did this multiple times with the golden dragon if you do look at the review over here um he does it does say to match him up with golden Dra dragon i don't know if this is a bug but if they do fix it then this could be an op team or actually an op unit to put in um is he op personally don't think so i think if i was to rate this guy out of 10 i would probably say he's a 7 out of 10 but this challenge one is actually kind of cool now many people are kind of curious on what on what team they should run use to actually run through this whole event depending on who is in this so this is this is our server so this is who we have to go up against one great way to complete it all you have guys have till the 19th so you have a couple days this is a team that we have that are it's running perfectly, to be honest. So, in this situation, his Gogeta is fast, okay? So, we made sure to put Zamasu here. The only person that we cannot take out is Zamasu. So, we made sure to keep Zamasu here so he gets contempted. And then all these units are going to... Now, as you progress, it's going to get tougher and tougher. Uh, some formations are going to be different. You know, I was playing around with this one. This guy has an AoE team, so we ran this team. It still worked out beautiful. Um, as you get... To stronger people, they're going to be more annoying with formations and whatnot. For example, this guy is in first. So I was running with this team, and this team worked out pretty well. Now, um, an AoE team worked out pretty good. If you guys want to try out an AoE team, you guys could run Kefla and Super Saiyan Blue Goku. That's a great team right here. You know, Gogeta's going to be contempting uh, Zamasu, and then Gotenks is just going to go to town on Belmod. Um, another team you could run, of course, is the one that I mentioned right here. We got Miris, Dispo, and Jiren. Uh, so for example, we'll show you guys exactly what happens. Now, as for positioning, um, this right here, your battle order, is who goes first. Now, it doesn't matter if I put uh, Jiren first. Because of Dispo's ability, he has to go. Um, he's really fast. So I'll just leave it like this. And I'll show you guys exactly what I'm talking about. So once we start the battle right here, um, right away, we're going to get contempted. And then Belmod is going to get beat down by Jiren and Dispo. You're going to see how much damage uh, Dispo does. We got that little lucky Petrify, and then we skip it. And we ended up getting the win. And we could see right here that Jiren ended up doing 289 mil, where Dispo was right behind him with 282 mil. So like I said, if you guys want to run a team like this, and then all you have to do is switch people around so for example against gogeta if i was to do this i would potentially lose so just swap this around this one and you're going to go right to town and go all the way up up and away and then the best part about it is you're going to get that reward of 1400 gems so technically 2000 gems in total once you do this if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like comment subscribe and see you guys later peace impressive 